identify as queer, and 20 to 40 percent of homeless youth, youth nationally say that they're LGBT. Whereas 40 percent of people with AIDS are either homeless or inadequately housed. And being evicted is the number one reason people with AIDS cite as why they became homeless. Whereas a Williams Institute study shows that the queer community is just as poor as, and in some instances poorer than, any other community. Whereas 75 percent of transgender people in the Bay Area are unemployed or only employed marginally, whereas people with AIDS are constantly facing cuts in their benefits, forcing them to live on less and less. Whereas affordable housing for seniors is a crucial need within our community all over the country, and the units that have been built are too few to meet the demand. Whereas queer neighborhoods throughout the country have been hit with speculation and gentrification, displacing lower income LGBT folks, be it resolved that therefore we call on the human rights campaign to make affordable housing, living wage jobs, the maintenance of benefits for seniors, people with AIDS and others, and health care for all, priorities! on both the local and national level. And just just so people know, this is Harvey Milk's old camera store. This is where he organized. Harvey built coalitions with labor. Harvey built built coalitions with people of color. In this space. With with uh, day laborers. Harvey Milk was a coalition, but Harvey Milk understood that we are in all communities and that all issues are our issues, That's especially right. economic justice ones. That's right. And we are asking the Human Rights Campaign to live up to the legacy of the man whose store they occupy. That's right. That's all That's arrested. Right. No sweatshop clothing. That's right. Thank no you. No sweatshop snow globe. Back out on the streets, everyone, for a wrap up. <laughs> Shame on it, Tony. 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 Shame on it, Tony.